Right, let's go. First ever Yu-Gi-Oh card unboxing stream. Depending on where it goes, we might get some more, but who knows? Right. Got my sleeves to pull them in. I might get me a folder out just so. Let's get some lo fi though. Get some lo fi. Legendary Duelists Season 3 pack from game. It was $12.99 as you can see, but reduced to $11.98, which is really good. It's the first one. I've already opened this box. I haven't checked all the cards properly, but um, the staff dials have done break the seal and just seen the cards, but not all of them. So this is the Speed Duel GX box, very nice. And then we've got this one I brought today, which was a little bit more expensive. It was $29.99. Yeah, Streets of the Battle. It's got eight decks in this, so I think it's real, really worth it. Really worth it. Contains eight decks, look. Very nice. Also got these sleeves as well. 25th edition, 25th anniversary edition. 25th quarter century. Damn son, I'm, I've also brought a new binder. Well, my partner brought me this. This was a £10 from game as well. I'll pull it on the big screen so you can see. Right on it. Very nice, isn't it? Very nice, very nice. Very nice. Anyway, for the video. Gonna be opening a card of the deck I've already got, the box I've already opened, which is this one, the speed deal one. Because it's the one I wanna have a look at the most because there's cards in this particular box that I did want to get, but I know I didn't. But I can also um put the sleeves on now. Which the sleeves are here. Gotta open the packet, guys. Just gonna open the sleeve packet. Green Guardian of the Fortress. Do I need to? Where's um? I think I need to flip it horizontally. Capture audio only. What now, do we? Trying to see if I can flip the camera. It's, uh, it's the wrong way, isn't it? I've got flip vertically on. That's not. Is that's upside down? Then look. Dobby has heard hey, your greatness. Hey, Kenny sir. Gaming. Dobby's heard your greatness. Look, if I flip it the right way, look. So it's facing the right way. It's just backwards. 
I need to flip it the other way as well, don't I? And I can't see how to do it. Chill vibes, oh Dan, chill vibes. That is crazy, man. Right, one sec, kid. Good, just eating. Yeah, man. Just seeing if I can put the camera the right way. Today, I'll be showing you how to flip your camera in Streamlabs OBS. Start by selecting your camera source. Right click on the source and go to transform, then choose ah. either flip horizontal or flip. focus gone there we go we got it the right way guys we've got it the right way let's go right so we're gonna start this from scratch right one sec now i'm not restarting the stream but i need to set it up again so i'm gonna put this on youtube so if i get it all looking nice oh shit kid i'm off already got <coughs> breaking things breaking things i know it's cool isn't it kid we're cool, aren't we? We're part of the cool guys now. All right, here we go. So here we go. This is what I've got today. I've got a brand new pack of sleeves, um, a season three legendary duelist twin pack, and I'll go through the prices in a sec. A box that I've already opened, Speed Jewel GX, and a God Card box holder. And I also brought a new binder today as well. Um, Here's a new binder, Dan. Check this baby out. Carly brought me this. £10. That's the Dark Magician girl. Goated. Absolutely goated. Anyway, back to the unboxing. So I'm going to open this pack of sleeves here. This is my new sleeves, 21st century. So it's tough to open, you know, these are. It's like trying to get into a... I don't know. It's really tough to get into... Get, I'll move everything out of the way that I'm going to unbox. So, yeah, this is what we've got, guys. Streets of the Battle City. Go. And I'll try and open these on camera so you can see, hear all the noises and shit. Mega map pack open. Yes, yeah, sir. I tell you, it's like rocket science, kid. I'm going to have to bite it. Oh. 
biting didn't even work, guys. Didn't even work. Ah, we're in. We're in. We're in. I don't know why I'm trying to show it on my small camera. Fucking in. Let's go. Big hype. Big hype. So, right. This is what it looks like, guys. Very nice. Beautiful. Very nice. So, I need to open it up. Yes, big hype, big hype. So these are just my sleeves. What I'm going to be putting cards into. They're beautiful. They are, aren't they? Look at that. Map pack. Ah, got your favourite map pack, kid. Find the new DLC, uh, Fjord Ventura. Great DLC. Uh, we'll put them down there in the extra deck slot. Right, here we go. So I've already opened this box, but I've not pro had a proper look inside. $15.99 from game. Ain't bad, is it really? $15.99. It's got like a mixture of maybe, I think, two decks. Um, a Speed Dual GX. I ripped that, sorry. A Speed Dual GX Dual Academy Starter Expansion Box. Talk about a rough teaching method. So this mini box includes... 100 common cards, four ready to play speed dual decks. So four decks. Really nice, isn't it? 12 skill cards, four secret rares, and I got a map as well, which is this. The um the mat came with it. Oh, we're ready prepared today, ain't we kid? Anyway, let's get to the unboxing. Woohoo! Oh, I've lost I've got some cards that I've uh, flew over here. There's meant to be a shiny one there. Well, these are some of the cards here. There we go. So there, there. So this is what it came like. This is pretty much what it came like, kid. Map, um, Nactar Orton. Nactar Orton, kid. So uh, these are pretty common cards, but you might get the odd shine. Yeah, I've got shinies, kid. Got shinies. So Elemental Hero, Avian. Elemental Hero Bursting Atrix, Elemental Hero Clayman, Elemental Hero Sparkman, Goddess with the Third Eye, Winged Karibo, Dark Catapulter. Bear in mind, Dan, these are all effect monsters, these are. Elemental Hero Bubble Man, Elemental Hero Blade Edge, Elemental Hero Wild Heart, Elemental Hero Blaze Man. Favorite card, Polymerization. It's just, I just love the, love the look of it. It's just so nice. And they smell so good. As you should know. I've got um, R Heated Heart. R Right Justice. Skyscraper 2 Hero City. I mean, they are pretty common. I know everyone just wants to get to the unboxing, but I'll just scan through them now. So Ambulance Roid. That's pretty funny. Pretty funny indeed. So yeah, not more. See, when they're light yellow, they don't have an effect. When they're like an orange color, Dan, that they have an effect. These are energy uh, spell cards, but they call them magic cards in the, uh, the TV series. These are trap cards. So they say spell there. Look, but they're called magic cards in the series. So these are all. Oh, these are all fusion monsters. Look how many fusions I've got. Four. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. So this card here, it requires Gyroid and Steamroid to summon it. I have got them in here. Look at these ones, Dan. Crass Clown. This is Kyber's deck, this is. And this one as well, Jurai Gumo. Look at this, it's got 2,200 attack points. 2,200. That's insane. For a four-star monster, that is insane. I'd have that in your deck. The reason why I don't like Shadow Gold is it's five stars. Look. This Shara Jarai Gumo's got more attack power for a four-star monster. That makes no sense, does it really? That's the way it is. Stone statue of the Aztecs. Ryu Kishin Clown. Kaiser Seahorse. That's a nice monster, to be fair. It's got reasonably equal attack and defense. Let me just put my other headphone in. I'm enjoying these vibes. Yeah. Right, so we're at Kaiser Seahorse, guys. Still there. Still there. Still there or thereabouts. <laughs> Unshaven Angler. That's a nice card. 
so shiny as well, isn't it? You can probably see the shine to the cards. Brand spanking new, isn't it? Whirlpool, Prodigy, Soul Exchange. That's a good card as well. I'd be very, hand, very handy to have that in your deck. More trap cards. Eight, loads of skill cards. I love these skill cards, man. I might put them at the top. I'll put them at the top. Putting them at the top. Putting them at the top, yo. Putting them at the top. In the middle top, yo. Behold, Gate Guardian. These are nice. I do like these. Hmm. Really good. Really good. Right, so to the other deck. I hope this has got my. Yes. These are the ones I did see. So this is a. So in game, close to home then. No, I went to I went to um my council appointment today and it was in Stafford. In Stafford kid. In the Sports Direct. Yeah, done. Look at these shinies. We'll go through them one by one. Check that out, kid. Three thousand attack. The focus. There you go. So it's a fusion monster. Jumbo drill. So I'm going to put that in a sleeve. Mega shinies. Hell yes. Um, there he is. Nice back look. Really nice cards. Really nice. That on there. Sang of the Thunder. You see, I needed this is a card that is one of three, uh, one of one of four. There's Sang of the Thunder, and there's two others. I've got them in this deck, but they're not shiny like this. So I am gonna put it in a sleeve. I don't know yet. I haven't know. Dan, this is just the first box, kid. I told you it's a big stream, man. This is gonna be big. I've got to open all these. I haven't even opened. I've got Two more boxes to open, but one of them's got six decks in it, kid. So there we go, we've got that in the packet. Put that on the stream so you guys can see it. The next one here, the shiny we have. The thing to kick in. Doggo Ran, the Mad Flame Kaiju. Look at this. 3,000 attack, 1,200 defense. Proper nice shiny, that is. Very nice. Yeah, damn, we've got loads of cards to open up yet, mate. Loads of cards. That's why I'm trying to just skim through this pack because I just want to put the shinies... Look at my face reflection there. Fuck off. Just put these shinies into the packs and then put the commons back in the box and then I can crack on then opening the other ones. And then you'll see my reaction to opening them. I'll know if I get a good one. So this is a magic card called A Hero Lives. Goated. It says, um, I'll let you guys read it when it adjusts. If you control no face-up monsters, pay half your LP. Special summon one level four monster with... Or lower elemental hero. You've seen all them elemental heroes before, didn't you? It's definitely a, a deck that's going to be very good in battle. Pulling all them elemental heroes out. But if you've only got one of them, you'd want to have three of them in your deck. TBH. So here we are. Oh, Dan. I love these cards. Love them. Did you watch the fight? Yeah, I did. I did. He got knocked straight out, didn't he? Barely lasted five seconds. Barely lasted five seconds. Who, Paul Smith? No. Let's see, let me just show you this now, kid. Um, so this card here, it's not shiny, but it's really good. 3,750 attack, 3,400 defense. Summon, cannot be normal summoned or set. Must first be special summon from your hand by attributing one Sanger, Kaisergen and Suigen. So I've got... That's the one I've already got, yeah? We've got it's a shiny there, look. They're both the same. Sanger of the Thunder. But I actually have got the ones that go with it. So lit. This is like a set here. Look at them. They're beautiful. 
absolutely beautiful. And to be honest, I'm really tempted to put them in packets as well. Because of the just of the rarity alone. I just goated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm doing it, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. That's the set. You have to have them free on the field and then your polymerization into them. Fucking insane. Fucking insane. I need to buy some more packs by the look of it, don't I? Gate Guardian! Such a nice card. So yeah, Dan, how are you doing, kid? What are you up to? You pop in. I was like, I'm going to do this for a couple of hours. I'll probably get an early night, me and Carly said. You know, I'm doing really well, man. Keeping everything in check. Little boys having some of these. Um, they're called Bicky. Bicky Pegs. Bicky Pegs. Yeah, they're really cool, man. He just puts them around his wrist and he just chews them. I'll have to send you a video. So, all right, here's the first cards I've got in packets Sanger, that one, that one. And then the set. Very nice. Nice. I do apologise. I should have a quick scan through these because I did last time. So what's this? You have our oh, winged Karibo that goes with luck. So they're all like connected. They're all connected, guys. Elemental heroes. Look, it's just they're all like everywhere. There's fusion ones and there's effect ones. Whoa, they're all elemental heroes. I've got five of them here. That's goated. Water dragon. Oh, that's a nice dragon. If that was a four star, that'd be lit. <clears throat> JK, JK. I'm not joking, but it would never be a four star. Never in a million years. So it's having a quick scan. Just having a quick scan, guys, so you can see what they are. Yeah, they are very nice. They're all part of like each other's deck. Is that shiny? No. Desk Koala, very nice. Sea Koala, very nice. So slidey. Team of Fuse. Whoa, look how many stars that is. It's got question marks, attack, and defense, Dan. It means it's good. Let's see how what it does, kid. To the thing he sets up. A fusion. <laughs> Making no noise and pretending that I don't exist. A fusion summon of this card can only be done with the above fusion monsters. The original attack of this card becomes the combined original attack of the two materials used for its fusion summon. So, I'm put, so if you had a warrior monster that was like 3,500 attack, that's what this would become, plus the Euphoroid. So it does give you that chance to really increase your attack and defense. Nice. And yeah, and this is just, it's not the strongest one, but that other one was really good. I might put that in a packet as well. Your Ephroid. No, I'm not going to put it in the packet. I'm just doing it for them ones because um, they're like really good cards. I'll be in my bedroom making no noise and pretending that I don't exist. Hey. Right then, Kenny. First box done. 50.99. Thumbs up to that one, guys. I really enjoy that deck. Well, then, decks. All right, next one is a another bargain it's a little bit cheaper so it was 12.99 but they reduced it to 11.98 because it's apparently it's older it's just a legendary duelist one there it is in all its fine glory all right we'll go continue with the unveil kid we'll unveil it very shortly They've got the, the Konami seal, so you know they're proper legit. They're proper legit, mate. You ain't getting more legit than this. Yeah, yeah. Just undoing the tape, guys. Undoing the tape. Sorry, I should have it on camera, shouldn't I? So I've got really strong thumbnails, so that does help. So I just, I've got to pick at it a few times, but I'll get there in a few weeks. Few weeks or a few years, one or the other. Are you the jet? No, I don't even exist. Oh, 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 oh! Damn it! Thought that was going to be good then, but it wasn't very good. Only a bit came off. Look at it. 
Look at it. Really shocking. You know, I'm so tempted to get a knife. Oh, I've used my nail to cut it there. Look, I did my nail in that gap. Like this. My nail in that gap. All right. Hey, there's one side. Get the nail in there as well. Drop it. Just rag it. <laughs> Why is that? Why would you want me to rag it? You want me to break my shit? This side doesn't even want to do it. Doesn't even want to do it. So I'm just going to open it from there. Oh, we're in. I've got a dice. Let's go. We're in. There's the lid. Off. Off ski. Yeah. There's the packs, guys. I would just rag it. I did. I ragged it in the end. Rag and bone, man, ain't I? All right, so... Beautiful. Oh, look at that. <coughs> oh, it says you go there, look as well. Ever focuses. Focus. Focus. It's trying to, there you go. Yu Gi Oh! That's actually the six as well. That's pretty goated. Oh! Special card! Special card! What have we got? What have we got? Three, two, one. Predator Plant Triffa Triffy Overutum. Oh, it's very strong. 3,000 attack, 3,000 defense, plant, fusion. It needs dark monsters on the field. Three dark monsters on the field. You take it with chicken. Oh, we're opening it up. Good. Don't rip it, though. For fuck's sake. Don't fucking rip it, for fuck's sake. We fucked. Oh, there it is. No, it's glory, guys. Predator plant. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Look at that card. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's just goaded. Hmm. Needs a popping right now, my friend. Another one in its packet, in its home. Let's go. Got another dice somewhere. I swear I have. I need to find that dice, actually. Right, first pack. This is quite hefty. This pack's quite thick. It's a, it's a legendary Duelists Season 3 First Edition Konami pack. Beautiful. Right, let's open it together, guys. Unbox the unboxed. Some people, you know, when they unbox these, they know where the um, the shine is. So they'll just whip it out quick and put that to the side, but I don't know. So what we'll do, we'll just flip it together. Right, we've got Earthbound Whirlwind. Pretty common. Supreme King's Castle. I don't, I don't know these cards, by the way. Evil Dark. Evil Dark. Evil Hero Dark Gaia. Whoa. That's a pretty cool monster, that is. That's pretty cool. It needs one fiend monster and one rock monster to be summoned. Ooh, look at this one, Dan. Moon Dragon Quilla. Synchro card. Really cool. It needs Supe and one non-tuner monster. It needs tuna sandwiches, good, basically. An evil hero. Evil hero. So we've got elemental heroes and we've got evil heroes. This is what we're finding out. Oh, look at that one. Evil hero, malicious edge. It's quite a strong monster, to be fair. Oh, we'll come up to the shinies now. Fire ant Ascator. Oh, it's got 1300 defense. It's not a bad if you put it in defense position face down. 
Oh, here we go. Here we go. Look at this. What we got here? Evil Hero Inferno Wing. Uh, it's not very strong, but it looks very cool. Let's go in a packet. Oh my god, we got the same one twice. We literally got the same one twice. Literally exactly the same. That's crazed. That is wilding, guys. Absolutely wilding. Two of the same. The next one is called Tuning. That's a really nice shine. That is really nice. Add one Synchron Tuner. Add one Synchron Tuner from your deck to your hand, then send the card off your deck to the graveyard. That's very long-winded, isn't it, kid? There you go. Add one Synchron Tuner from your deck to your hand, then send the top card of your deck to the graveyard. That's a lot of mechanics there, isn't it, for a card? Predaponics, that sounds like it's something to do with that Preda plant, to be fair. So these ones are probably reached. Oh, that's quite strong. 2,800 attack points. Very nice. And then we just got uh, some more commons. And then we've got this nice card. XYZ monsters. There you go, guys. Got some more of them. Boop, boop. Yeah, there's all the cards that we got in the first pack. Very nice. I'm going to put them in the packs now. Yeah. Put them back in the packs. Because we're having such a blast. Yeah, yeah. There we go, kid. These are all the cards that we've collected within the, I'd say like the range, and but these ones are just a collection, so I will keep them separate, the Gate Guardian and that, but these ones are very nice. But all these lovely shinies, guys, doing very well. The next pack, guys. Going to move on to. Oh, it was mint, Dan. I wish I could have it again right now. To be fair, I really do. I could eat that all again, right now. All right, next pack. So you get two packs in that one pack, there, guys. So we're pretty Gucci. Another big ass pack. There we go. The smell of them is just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful, guys. There we go. Earthbound Immortal Chaku Chola. Very nice. Earthbound, look, this one is. Very earthbound. Super, I've seen that with a, a fusion monster somewhere. Oh, look at that. Oh, Ebon Illusion Magician. He's got the same attack and defense as Dark Magician. No freaking way. That's a very nice card. Very, very nice. Predator Price. Practice. Predator Practice. Very nice. It's got a lovely shine to it. Hey, yo. Or what is this one? Evil Hero. Lightning Golem. 2400 attack. Very nice. It needs Elemental Hero, Spark Man, Elemental Hero, Clay Man to summon. Then these are other common cards. Oh, we've got a Gaga Ga. Ga 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 Ga. Magician. <laughs> Pretty cool. Two for eight equal for attack and defense. Four star monster. Can be summoned straight away. There we go, guys. That's the first pack. I just want to see where that other pack is. That add my dice in one sec. What feeling? Mm. 
We have to pull the tins out, ain't we? These are my Pokemon cards. Whoops. Just knocked all them off. Yeah, they're my dice. Found them. Just literally. I literally knocked every single pack on the floor, which is pretty wilding. But I've got them all, they're recovered, back in play. So this is my good little tin here. And obviously I've got other dice in there, so I'm just gonna add this dice to my collection. I've got cards everywhere, guys, honestly. Cards are even these. I won't even check what cards these are. We're literally in the middle of an unveiling and I'm going through my old Yu Gi Oh cards. So many. I've built my collection up so much. It's hard to get these up, look. Uh, so that one's pretty nice. Shiny. That's shiny. Well, there, I've got sewage in. No way. Oh my god. I need to see what I mean. I need to go through them all down. But I'm gonna take that sewage in out because I've got I've got the other deck, can I, with that? So that'll go with my them cards. So yeah, guys, this is for another time. I've got so many Yu-Gi-Oh cards. I need... What's that? Is it toast? Looks like toast. <laughs> you need toast, kid. Or is it a, a file? Is it a file? So this is just one tin. I've got fucking shitloads, man. Absolutely shitloads. I want to see them. I'll do for now, won't it? Oh, folders. <laughs> what are you like? What are you like? So I'm going to keep these tins out for now. These folders, lad. This is my sarcophagus box. This was the first one I ever brought. This was the first one I ever brought, this was. I'll see if I... It's got just a tin in it for now. You'd think it'd be something special, wouldn't you? It is. Do you know what these are, actually, Dan? These are fake Yu-Gi-Oh cards. These can actually get you banned. Not banned. But they look into you. These are fake Yu-Gi-Oh cards. They've got a weird smell as well. They're fake. Look at this one. Look how fake it looks. That. Just what I've collected over the years, kid. Look how fake that looks as well. You might not be able to tell. Yeah, <laughs> it looks like toast. <laughs> so all the cards that were in this went came with um two now. <laughs> yeah, the cards that came in that tin are in that folder now. But I've got the Switch back as well, Dan, so we're going to do a Mario Kart stream soon, my friend. Big Mario Kart stream. Right, we're going to put this in the packet and then get onto the last box. Uh, this can go in. Oh. Here we go. Oh, I've got to put these in as well. Just one of them thing. Two what? Two shinies. Dan, I've got so many, kid. I've got so many I need to go through. I need to buy so many more of these sleeves. As long as I've got protectors on, you're pretty good. You are pretty good. Oh, there you go. 
Oh, Mario. Yeah, no, I am doing it. I've got the switch here. I could play Mario Kart like that now, literally. I literally get to put it back. It, Miley borrowed it for a bit, so I got it back today. It's, she said she doesn't play it anymore. It's just cluttering it up a room. Where's the sewage in? Uh, if I put all the, I put the, that one up there, and then all the thingies together. Sangre of the Thunder. So we've got Infusions Air, the XYZ at the front, and then I'll probably have that nice one, yeah, that one. And Sangan. They're the shinies. And then the shiny sewage in. Because they're the shinies again. And then Gate Guardian at the front. I might put Sangan next because I've got him as a shiny, then sewage in. There we go. Going to have a quick pop. Hey, yo. Enjoy yourself, kid. Have one for me. Do you want me to wait for you to come back then to open this last box? This is the last box I've got to open. Do you want me to wait? Seven slices, you get it? Oh my God. Say, I'm dense. Fucking hell, Tony. That's it. No, we're all having one each. Got one each, kid. Right. I'm back to it. This is what we're opening next. The Bad Boy. Streets of Battle City. It's got the security tag still on it as well. It's goaded. Got to be going, still got that. Any leftovers, man? Of course. Try and sell them back to them then. 40 quid. Trying to get these open is a nightmare. Should be equipped for this, guys. Hey, yes. Opening a Yu-Gi-Oh! Pop box. I've just opened uh, two other ones. I've got some other shinies here. Oh, to put them in the sleeves as well, mate. Proper on it, mate. Proper on it. Proper on it. Of course. Love a shiny. I'm just... A I haven't become proper equipped. I'm struggling to get inside this beast. It's quite heavy, it is. It's got six decks in it. I'm trying to use my nail. I've got quite strong nails, but it's not quite strong enough for this. I'm trying to look around for anything. What's the best pulled? Uh, not, I've not really pulled. I, I don't know, really. I just do it for nostalgia, but I might have pulled some good ones. I might have. I'd have to look on the internet, but I don't buy them to like see the rarity. I'll just like looking at them and seeing what they do. I actually like using them, guys. I actually like jeweling with them. You can actually jewel on like video chats and stuff. I haven't done it yet because I'm not very good at it. I'm just learning, you know. But I've always loved Yu-Gi-Oh. But it's, it's, it's become so complicated. It's crazy. There's so much going on. So much going on, mate. And I'm literally just destroying this box. Oh, it's really hurting my fingers. Have I got my keys? I haven't even got my keys. I'm going to get a knife. I'm going to get a knife. We'll go and do it. I'll be one sec.
got the utensil. We've got the utensil. Yeah, it's like me with MTG, we played it since school until COVID really should get into it again. Yeah, I totally agree, man. If you love it, you get going for it, man. But if things are worth money in years' time, you know, if your kids are still into it, you just, I don't know, guys. I've never really looked at it like that, to be honest. But I, I, that's what people do do. And I, I'm just not a money maker type person. I'm really not. I just like to look at things and just appreciate the artwork, you know. That's all I like to do. So anyway, we're in. We're in Gaza. $29.99 from games. Not bad, is it? Not bad at all. Should just give it a little shake. It should. Oh, God. That's tough, that is, mate. It's stuck on something. Oh, we're still connected. Still connected this side. Right, here we go. Now it's coming off. Ta-da! Oh, all the dark magician gold. So in terms of rarity, it's probably not worth a lot. Maybe a couple of quid, something like that. But it's such a nice card. What's the best card to get? Hey up, Barry, how's it going? The best card to get is probably... There's a mixture, man. There's a huge mixture. There's a card I'm going for called Black Luster Soldier. And I don't want to buy it singly. Because you can buy it singly, probably for a couple of quid, but I want to pull it. Uh, but I'll tell you the best card. I'll tell you the best cards is I've actually got them. I've actually got them for you, Barry. The best cards are Exodia. If you have these cards in your hand, the jewel's over, you win. Let's move this up. Move this out of the way. This is my big folder. It's, as you say, it's quite big. Yo, Zen, what are you doing? All right, so I need to like make myself some room. Got it. So them five, them cards there. See like this one this one that one and that one and that one if you have them five cards in your hand you win the game you win the game with them cards so i'm filling this folder as well i've got so many cards I've, i'm doing another stream another time where i'm sorting through them <laughs> oh sorry stream no if so it's off in oh thanks leif i keep calling you leif still because that's what i refer to you as Hey, my, my stepdad got me this watch for Christmas. I've had it on every day. And I got this um, bracelet here. Me and Miley brought this when we went to Mallorca. She's got a pink butterfly and I got the blue one. And Carly brought this when we first got together. It's like two magnet things. That's a little magnet there. That's awesome. Yeah, I know. Berry, we're loving life, mate. Anyway, back to the unveiling. Back to the unveil. Best cards, Exodia, by the way. I answered the question. Fair play. You can keep calling me Leif. It's my name anyway. Oh, yeah, of course. I'm always going to call you Leif, man. So anyway, this is a little pack. It's got, got, I think, about four cards in there. But guys, this is the Dark Magician, but it's the dark one. There's a different one. It's got different artwork. I'll show you. So you can get different varieties of the same card. So that's that Dark Magician there. Let me find me one in this folder quick. There he is. Yeah. See, they're the same card, but different artwork. Same card, even the same attack power. The ultimate wizard in terms of attack and defense, even the same writing. Just all this is shiny. It's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. But even there, look. Um, that's what this you, this card here is when you have three blue eyes. And you can actually get three different types of blue eyes. And there they are. I have them too. But they're not shiny. They're just normal. I'm going to try and get to my name it in the way. You know what it says. So this one, this one, this one. They're the same card. Same name. Same attack. 
Same attack and defense. Same description, but the same thing. <clears throat> yeah. Here's a bit of a Yu Gi lesson for you guys. So, we're going to open this little pack up now and see what else I got in here. I don't have a clue what I've got. I don't know the rarity. You guys can check it out if you want to. It's just a di it's just a different artwork, Dark Magician. Cartoony. Oh yeah, that's probably um, a Blue Eyes Toon Dragon. Toon Toon World is so good. Oh my god, I re actually really love that deck. Coming to think of it now, if you guys, I could show you one here quick. Uh, I'll put the display capture up. Oh. All right. I've got my Yu Gi background on just for the stream, just for the stream. So, uh, Tune World. This deck is amazing. I might actually buy this because you've said that now. That's not it. Well, these are like the two that I don't think you can. I don't think you can actually get it as a structure deck. None of these are it. They're just other structure decks. The actual deck in the actual series, he actually has there's a magic card. There it is, Tomb World. This card here, Tomb World, and that lets you summon other cards that are tomb versions of monsters. Basically, look, Toon Dark Magician, Toon Mermaid, Toon Dark Magician. So they're just Toon version, Toon Summon Skull. But the, the special thing about them is I don't think they can be destroyed by normal attacks. They can only be destroyed by like magic or trap cards. And that was the difference. Hello. Yeah, Miley's here to eat a tea as well, guys. So anyway, I'm going to open this little pack. Yo, Strangling! What are you saying, fam? Hey, yo. Doing you know, you know, you know, what you're doing? Miley doesn't even know what I'm doing. Beep, beep. Yo, we're unboxing Yu Gi Oh cards, as you can tell. I've got some decent cards that I've got already. I'm not sure of rarity, though, so I'll run you through them, guys. Who's new here? Not new, but who haven't been here today. This is the first Yu Gi Oh stream I've ever done as well. So I appreciate you all stick, stick, coming by and sticking around talking shit with me. I just talk shit all the time. People do think these are shit, but I do love Yu Gi Oh. And there is a little market for it. People do love them. I love them too. Isn't that right, Miley? Best way. Exactly, guys. You stick to what you know, innit? There's loads of people out there who are doing so well at what they do, but I'm not them, am I? You know, I like watching this guy called Nick Merckx. He's got like millions of viewers on Twitch. But I think he's gone to kick now. But um, yeah, I respect him, man. He's a great guy. He's a dad as well. He's not long had a kid. Fair play to him. Nick Merckx is class. So anyway, the, un the unveil of this little pack. So we've got this Dark Magician, which I'm going to put in packs as well, guys. Oh my God. Slife of the Sky Dragon. Oh my god. Hollow. This is an Egyptian god card, guys. There's three of these. I've got them as well, but not full shiny like this. It's just a shiny writing. This is Slife of the Sky Dragon, Obelisk the Tormentor, and the Wing Dragon of Ra. You have them cards, you've got there. Yeah, that's a winner. Chicken dinner, that is, mate. Absolute chicken dinner. Oh, look at that as well. A three star monster is a full blown shiny. 1200 attack the effect as well look see there's certain cards guys that see that's just a normal yellow I, I've, I've skipped through that i shouldn't have really so it's just like a light yellow it's got no effect these like dark yellow cards they have an effect so i'll go back even slide for the sky dragon's got effect when the camera focuses in you'll be able to read it come on focus in you can see like the blue lights from the thingy, can't you? Look. Woo! There you go. Requires three tributes to normal summon. Cannot be normal set. 
There's cards, normal, summon. Do you know what I mean? There's just like a load of writing to read, man. You have to know what it does and stuff. It's crazy. So even this has got an effect as well. Monsters your opponent controls cannot target warrior monsters. See that the types of monsters are, are here. Three star monsters as well. So up to a three or four star, you can just normal summon. I've got the map under it, but the, the gaming thing under here. So here you place your trap cards and on here you can literally up summon either a four star or below any monster. But when it comes to like a five star or a star like this, you have to tribute summon, swap two cards for it or one. It's like a five star, I think it's just one, maybe a six as well. I'd have to look into it again, I really would. So right, anyway, back to it. Dark Renewal, this is a trap card, guys. Really cool card that is. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Beautiful. Kaiko, the Ghost Destroyer. So he's a four star. Decent attack power as well. 1800. <clears throat> nice, nice, nice. I got four very good cards. They are Blue Eyes, Cartoon Dragon, eight stars, Meteorite, Black Dragon, Labyrinth Panzer. And the best card I got is a shiny Endless Dragon with Blue Eyes with full star. Bro, damn, I just had memories when I used to trade. I know. I used to trade. I used to go to the shop called Two Fat Goblins and you buy a pack for £2.50 and you can get a card in there that's like worth £3, £4. So you just buy another pack and then keep the change. But sometimes you actually didn't. Sometimes you only get cards there that are worth like 50p. So you sometimes used to lose your money. It's just a bit of a gamble, really. The shop's still there, actually, in Stafford. So we've got Dust Tornado, that's a good one. This card here, look, it says here, there's like a... See there, Speed Jewel, that's awesome. Target one spell trap card your opponent controls. Destroy that target, then set one spell trap card from your hand. Such a nice card. Yeah, oh, guys, that is a beaut... That's Joey's card. The guy on the box here. I was just big on the series. That's Yugi on the left, and that's Joey on the right. That's like his, his right-hand man, his best mate. Goes for everything with him. He's a good duelist, but he's no Yugi. Yugi's the god. Yugi's the best. He's the one who has Exodia. So yeah, red eyes and anti-magic arrows. Let's go. So I'm going to sleeve all these up. I saw a small pack in a shop. It had... Like, not very much cards. It was over 10 euros. Yeah, it's because of the... You're probably going to get cards in there that are going to be worth up to 10 euros, but you could get a card that's worth more than that. It's, it is. It's gambling. It's basically a gamble. It's basically a gamble, my guy. If you want to see it like that. It all depends how you want to see it. But there's a the particular pack to win it. Yes, sir. The, I'm looking for a card, though. I'm showing, you what, I'm showing you what card now I'm looking for. It's called Black Luster Soldier. But you can't just get that card. You need Black Luster Ritual to summon this guy. He's, he's not like the strongest either, but I just love his artwork. I love the color of the card. I just love it. And I just really want this card again. I used to have it. I'm going to show you another card I really want, but I want this one more. This one. So I can buy it. 18 euros. So nice. But you have to have an, an, a magic card called Black Luster Ritual. Why wouldn't people look for Black Luster Ritual as well? You think, like, people also viewed that it would be Black Luster Ritual. So here's the ritual card. This is really nice. These are really nice cards, guys. You see by the price. Very good. But this is the card you have to have with it to summon it. This card is used to ritual summon Black Luster Soldier. You must also tribute monsters from your hand in total to what they are. In total to what his stars are. And because he's a eight star monster, I think it is there. One, two three four eight yeah i think it's two cards so you have to tribute someone two monsters already on the field and use that magic card to get this guy on the field he's got no effect he's just a nice beastie strong guy 
with a sword. On the on the series, he's amazing. Oh, absolutely amazing. You guys need to watch the series to actually feel what I felt about it. It was amazing. Oh, I've put this one in backwards. What the hell? What the frick? Sheesh. My favorite MTG cars is Ice Age Baron Sengir. Oh, are they cards, are they? Are they cards as well, are they, guys? I'll have to have a quick look at them as well in a sec. Oh, the actual cars. Oh, the car. Are they cards or cars? Oh, I need to shout you guys out as well. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> what am I doing? I need to shout out Gaz, Leif. So sorry, guys. And strangling. I got his feeling. Somebody's watching me. Watching <laughs> Somebody's watching me. Guys, it always sounds like you've had a few drinks, but I know it's not. Oh, nice volume, Leif. Loving the volume. Loving the volume, by the way. And then Strangling. Give her the shout as well. She's a legend. Let you guys see that. She's goated as well. She is goated. But she's made me like to have a laugh like we all do. It's all about playing it, having a laugh. I didn't know it plays clip. Yeah, of course it does, my guy. So I'm just going to um, um, pack these three now, guys, into sleeves. Then we're going to open these six packs. I might. I think it's actually four. It could even be. I think it's four. Yeah, it's four. I've, I've, if it's six, I'm going to be well excited to look through them decks. Six decks. I'm be like, right. It's going to be wild. One structure deck is like uh, eleven ninety nine as well. So it's well worth the money. Well worth it. Did you sound which it was, guys? I think I did. $29.99. Just anyone else who didn't see it. $29.99. That's what I paid for this. That feature is nice. What, playing the clip? I thought you knew how to do that. It's all right. All right. That's one. No, I need one. <laughs> My beard's so long right now. My hair looks different. I've grown it for quite a while now. I've been growing the top. Since I've had my baby, since I've had the baby, I've just been um, growing my hair and beard as much as I can. I don't know why. It's just one thing I did. Just carried on doing it. Cheers, bro. Appreciate that, my guy. It's getting there, isn't it, man? Okay, now it's got a bit of length to it. It's got a bit of length to it. But I'm getting old, remember? I'm getting old. Looks good to me. Cheers, guys. Just got to look after yourself, aren't you, my guy? <laughs> Rizzler. Rizzler paper. Rizzler is, in the UK, is a type of paper that people use to roll cigarettes. <laughs> no, I know that don't matter. I've done the rizzing that I need to do, and I leave. I've already ri Oh, my God. This is a... Oh, my God. This is nearly a pack. I thought it was going to be a pack of thingy. A pack of... Um, what are they called? Skill cards. So, yeah. These are called skill cards. I'm quite new to these. Lev, don't make me laugh. Because I'm trying to be focused. I'm going to try and make a YouTube video out of this. So, I'm going to try and remain somewhat focused. Got Miley behind me as well being cute in a onesie thing. Hi. Love you. Oh, it's a lot. It's quite a big deck. I've got bloody five more in there, I think, or three more. <laughs> right, so all wizardry, all these ones, blah, 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 blah. You guys have to look through these at a later date. I'll, you'll be able to slow them down. I want to get to the deck. Oh, summon skull. Oh, my God, this deck is nice. I know I am very thick, and I? I know I'm a chunky guy, highly chunky. So we've got them there. I'll put them there. <laughs> Not you, bro. <laughs> Don't make me laugh, Leif. Oh, my. Oh, school, the Summon Skull. This is a nice card. It is very nice. Smells good as well. Smells so good. 
Guys, if you guys, the one thing about Yu-Gi-Oh cards, you've got to smell them. And when you smell them, you understand the true meaning of cleanliness. And that's how you got to aspire to smell like <laughs> an open pack of Yu-Gi-Oh cards. <clears throat> okay, so back to the deck. Back to the deck. You get flashbacks? Oh, of course. It's when I'm younger. Of course, man. And you're not even that old. Pack smell. It is the future. It actually is, guys. And it's been around for so long, you know. I used to watch other people doing these type of videos and they used to smell the packs too. <sighs> Just, you know it, don't you? You just know it. Just know it. Spot the packs. All right, so we've got the Summon Skull, Brain Crusher. A few other... Pretty standard cards. Pretty standard cards. Oh, Red Eyes Baby Dragon. I've never seen that before. It's only Red Eyes Black Dragon. Oh, that's a beast. Zera the Mant. It's not a shiny, but it's a very strong card. 2,800 attack. Ever focuses. Focus. There we go. You can ritual this card with Zera Ritual. Have I got that? Acid Rain, Book of Teu, Exchange, what was it called? With Zero Ritual, such a nice card, wasn't it, Leif? There it is. I was going to say, you can't get that card without that. This card is used from Zero Ritual. You must also do, it's the same thing as Black Luster Soldier. It's taunting me. It's taunting me. It wants me to have Black Luster Soldier. That is literally the same thing. Oh my God. That, them two there is literally what Black Luster Soldier does. I'm packeting them. I'm packeting them, Leif. So messy, aren't I? I'm messy with my cards. There they are. That's them. I'm gonna pack it them straight away because they're very nice and they remind me of the Black Luster Soldier. So that's, see guys, I just work off that, mate. They're probably worth about, probably not even 10p, but to me, they're worth millions of pennies. <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. So where are we up to? Uh, we sort of got to round the magic cards. Hey yo, exchange last day of the bitch. I mean witch, Dawson, blowback dragon. Hey, that's pretty uh, explicit. Skilled red magician. Very nice. Yeah, I open up. I haven't stole any cards. I haven't stolen any Yu-Gi-Oh cards. I promise. I purchased these. I have the receipt. I have, I have evidence. <laughs> I was trying to think of the word. I'm under interrogation in my own house. Damn, son. Damn, son. There we go. That's the first deck done with, guys. I do believe that's part of this deck, but we'll see. I'll put the skill cards back on there so we don't run out of room. I want to keep his face in it as well. I like his face being in the stream. That one keeps sliding. Come down here. Come down here. Look, he keeps sliding. He's got proper wizardry skills, this card has. Proper skills. All right, next deck. Red Eyes Black Jack. Oh, there you go, guys. Another the Dark Magician again. See, I'll have a few different types of that. You go gotta be in the stream. Oh, you get gotta be in the screen. Stream is the main character. That ain't Yugi. But I know what you're saying. Yugi, I have put him in the stream. He's been here. There he is. My dude. And But guys, if you actually watch the series, there's him who, that's Yami Yugi. That's, he's got a magician item. A, yeah, a magician, what's it called? A millennium item. It's a necklace that goes around his neck. And he solved it. And they released a spirit that's from a thousand years ago and it took over him. There's there's so many millennium items and people actually possess them and do stuff. 
So uh, let's have a little check. What was I checking again? Um, oh yeah, Yugi. See that that's you that that's literally Yugi when he's normal as a normal kid. See how his 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 hair's face down. So this is Yugi Moto. I don't know why it's showing. Uh, I just want to see a picture. But anyway, you can see in there anyway, can't you? And then when he gets and when when he gets possessed like by the spirit in the Millennium Puzzle. He goes, Yu-Gi-Oh! And he turns into this guy who's on my screensaver. And then he also uh, gets this finger on his head when he's getting a lot of energy. So cool. It's just goaded. It's just so good. And, that, and of course, obviously, the Dark Magician belongs to Yugi. They just go hand in hand. See how it's just like the colours just bounce off each other. It's so good. So good. Right. Back to the next deck. Back to the next deck. I've only got. I wanted to have a little game of Apex before I let, before I went. I'm gonna edit this and put this on YouTube. But you've seen it live, Leif. You're a legend, you are, mate. Absolute legend. Supporting man. Absolute go ahead. So I'm so messy as well. Look, I just plonked the rubbish right there next to me, like it's nothing. These decks are quite chunky. These are so many cards. Smell them. Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh, wow. That took me to a place better than heaven. Oof, guys, they're good. Do you want to sniff, mate? Have a whiff of them, kid. Whoa. Bro, hide. <laughs> Hi, on Chaney, God. Hi, yeah, whoa, that's not me about. It's got me. It's got me, Leif. <laughs> you guys are tickling me, man. Oh, I thought this was just going to be me just talking shit on my own. Honestly, I really did. It's just goaded how it's ended up. Thank you so much. Yes, yeah, so I've got the red eyes in this deck. Pretty standard cards, and after that... I've got that in loads of decks as well. He's not like, he's Joey's main card, so he has got a lot of value, but yeah, he's just normal, really. He's just normal. It's just normal. That's a good card as well, Magician of Faith. It says, target, flip. It's a flip. So when you're dueling, guys, I'll give you a little example here. So you see how it's like shaped like a card there? You can either summon it like that. That's just a normal summon. Summoned in defense position or flip summoned. So if you put a monster like that and they attack you, it won't do any damage to your life points and you get to use the effect of the monster when it's flipped. And which says target one spell in your graveyard and add that card to your hand. So it's a pretty good little card. I've always known that as a good card, the Magician of Faith. Good card. Mask of Darkness. Sphere Karibo, I've never heard of that. There's a normal Karibo, and I've seen a different Karibo, really, which I can't remember the name of. Very nice decks, guys. Very nice decks. Got quite a few cards in them. Can't believe it, man, how many cards. Whoa, I've got two Dark Magicians there. Look, just randomly there. Oh, my God. Two Dark Magicians just sat there. You go better than Pokemon? I think so. It's a lot more in depth. But I do like Pokemon too. I really do. I think there's a lot more to... There's a lot of mechanics in Yu-Gi-Oh! Which people won't understand. Two Dark Magicians. No fucking way. I am going to wrap them up. I'm, I'm actually going to do the red eyes for Joey. I am. I'm doing it, guys. I'm doing it, mate. I'm doing it, mate. But I won't do it now. I'll just put them there for now. Know what I mean? Oh, let's crack on. Dark Magician. Dark Magic Curtain. It's a nice name for a card. Dark Magic Attack. He used to do that in the episode. If you control Dark Magician, destroy all spell and traps your opponent controls. That is a goated, absolutely goated card. I'm bloody wrapping that. Oh my God. So good. So, so good. 
Dark Renewal. Oh, Revival Jam. Oh my god, this card. In the uh, in the series, this card, you attack it and it multiplies. It's effed. Oh, hi, Jay. Oh, sweet. Cheers, Leif. I've got a pint of black currant here, man. Cheers, buddy. Nice. Nice. Let's go. All right, Revival Jam. Well, we've got two of them. They're not that very powerful or anything. I don't think it does the same. When this card is destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard, you can pay a thousand life points, special summon it in defense position. Also, it just comes back in this, but in the series, it comes back and it duplicates. Literally like that. Hey, Fortnite emo, let's go, man. I might play that, actually, instead of Apex after this. I'm not sure. We'll see. Humanoid Slime. That's got insane defense. Look at that, 2,000 defense for a four-star. That's huge. So you just whack that like there, guys, on the side, defense position. So they've got to have a pretty strong monster to take that down. Take that down. Hash Brown. Grizzly Mother. Mother Grizzly. Jam breeding machine. Oh, I think this is what makes it duplicate. Once per turn, join a standby phase. Special summon one slime token. Aqua water level one. Attack 500. Defense 500. In attack position. You cannot summon any monsters except slime tokens, but you can set. Oh my god. They brought the OG back map. Yeah, they did. I know, it was really nice. I've had a couple of goes of it, to be fair. It is really nice. It is really nice. Another good card, Polymerization. That fuses cards together. Pretty goated. It's pretty goated. That's another deck done. Two decks done in that. Which one did you have? The two fish. Two fish. Oh, revival jams. Them. Two fish spinning. Sp Sinister serpent. Where is the? Oh, that. Is it? Yeah, yeah. That's the card that you use to fuse monsters together. You have to have this card. No, they're just... That one's a dragon, and that's just like a, a ghoul. Or some type of mon a ghost. But they fish. <laughs> it's because you're young. It's because you're young, man. And if you actually watch the series, it's insane. What are they? Saturday sticks. Oh, Manchu. Got some chicken satay sticks on the go. Look at these bad boys, yo. Yo. They're banging, my guy. Oh, thank you so much. I love you. Oh. This is the best thing to guys. The maps. Oh, uh, I've got play mats. Another play map. Chicken is delicious. I know satay chickens are. Oh, I, I went out for a meal last night and I had satay chicken with um, chicken tikka and oh my god, it was beautiful. It was just incredible, Leif. Really was. I love chicken too. Just looking to get into this deck. The other ones were quite simple. Just going through the top, innit? Going through the top, lads. Talking about food, I'm kind of hungry now. I know. I know. That's why I was only going to do a couple of hour streams just opening this leaf. I was only going to do a couple of hour one myself, just and then just edit the video and try and make a YouTube video out of it. But, um, I don't know. I've, I've had fun with you guys, so 
I might just leave it as a VOD. I might save the VOD as a highlight. Because I'm struggling so much to get into this deck. It's like it's it's telling me, guys, there's a good card in there, isn't they? It's telling me. Hey, you better put the smelling part in the video. Oh, of course. Of course. Oh, I'm in. Getting high. I know I should just clip that actually and just put getting high off Yu-Gi-Oh cards. That would be jokes. Legendary Fisherman. This is one for you. You like fish, don't you, Leif? Oh, look, definitely. Look, Fly Fang. Nice card. Needle Sunfish. Oyster Meister. Pearson Moray. Maiden of the Aqua. Fiend Kraken. You hate fish. <laughs> okay, I, you'll love this, then. Gullard Fish. I don't like fish either. I hate the smell of fish. Always have done, man. I think it's vile. Oh, a fortress whale. WFH. Very nice card. Fortress whale. Salvage. Umi. That's a card that makes the field like... Um, if you have this up, like all fish type monsters do like stronger damage. Braves flabbergasted. Obviously. All day long, mate. All day long. I'm in the sea of dreams. I'm in the sea deck right now. Fortress Whale's Oath. I think that's what's used to su summon the whale. Yeah, it is. It's the same as the Black Luster Soldier thing. I might have them in my deck. Might have to make a deck out of them, innit? I like fish, but not the taste. I like to go fishing. I like fishing, but I don't like the smell of fish. It's disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. Never like the smell of fish. See if we pull another good card, guys, out of this deck. I think it's all quite a standard deck, to be honest. These are all, like, cards that you find in standard decks. Worth pennies, really. Oh, that's nice. Jinzo. Very nice card. Jinzo Lord. Jinzo Returner. They're a different um, attack thing. Jinzo Returner. He's tiny. I just generally like aquatic. Oh, me too. You see, I love the turtles and stuff like that. But fish, I do not like the, the smell of them at all. Their food smells a bit funny. But it's tolerable. It's only a quick smell. They should add an act. Lord card then. <laughs> a Lord Act card. <laughs> that would be funny as fuck, dude. Yeah, there's that deck, guys. See, all the, the, the decks that are in here, there's like a mixture of like, because there's three packs, it's actually six decks. So it's like on half of one. So that takes up... So there's six decks in three packs. So there's two decks in one of the packs, isn't they? So one of them packs is two decks long. They added Jinzy, Lord. So, oh yeah, exactly. I remember Jinzo. Still pumping on them Sato sticks. We right, Let's pack at these bad boys up. That fucking things up. I'm so bad at remembering names. Leif, trust me, mate. It's funnier than you make them up. <clears throat> trust me, bled. Oh, pull it in backwards. Keep doing that, don't I? Pulling the card in backwards. It's much funnier when you get the names wrong, isn't it, Leif? Like, instead of saying, like, Abracadabra, you're like, what's that Abracadabra's called? 
Like, it's just more funnier, isn't it? IMO. Some people are just dead serious all the time, aren't they? You'd, but I'm just like, I like to have a laugh. You're like a substitute teacher. And your spelling's probably worse than your um, remembering. <laughs> Joking, man. Be goated in every way, shape, or form, mate. Trust me. Oh, I've been doing that off screen, haven't I? What an idiot. So these are the cards I've packeted already. The nice cards. So the Fortress Whale, the Fort. I need to get Black Luster Soldier in this deck. Dark Magician Attack, Dark Magician, Dark Magician, Red Eyes, Zero, Zero, fucking what's it called again? Black Luster Soldier. Some nice ones. That's shiny Red Eyes, Dust Tornado. These ones are pretty much shiny now. That Dark Magician shiny is so nice. Very nice cards. Redder Plant. And that's the Gate Guardian set. Love that Gate Guardian set so much. Boom. Going really well. Right, last deck. The last deck. I'm sure I just felt the lace. Boom Town Rats. So what you're gonna have to eat, Leif? What you're gonna have to eat, mate? You're gonna have chicken. <laughs> have a little, little stick before I crack on. Right, first card off the bat, look. Dark Magician. He's getting packeted up, regardless, because he's a good card. I don't know why I didn't do the red eyes before as well. It was like, because he's such a key part of the series, he has to be in there. So yeah, Dark Magician goes down there. Skilled Dark Magician. That's pretty cool. But that's not him. See, they can just call other people Dark Magicians and just put other words there, but that's actually not him, though. He's not got the same attack defense. Alchemist of Black Spells. Blast Magician. Dark Magician Girl, let's go. He's getting packed at it. Buster Blader. What, the Dark Magician girl? There's a different version of her, which is probably a little bit more inappropriate. This card. He's got some sort of connection to the Black Luster Soldier. If he is in this deck, I'm just going to twerk for free. If Black Luster Soldier is in this deck, I'm going to twerk for free. Skilled White Magician. Breaker, the ma Magical Warrior. Apprentice Magician. Another Magician of Faith. Old Vindictive Magician. Malice Dispersion. Mage Power. Dark Paladin. Ah, oh, he's not in here. Don't worry, he's not in here. That's the one. Diffusion Monster. Gear Fiend. Time Wizard. This is Joey of Roth. Joey's deck, isn't it? Baby Dragon. No, I can't believe it, man. I thought it was... I, I had just a little feeling that it was going to be in here, man. I really did. I was so excited for a second. <sighs> Damn it. Damn it. I can't believe it's not in here. I really can't. 
I am. I'm gutted, Leif. I am actually gutted. Gonna have to another shot, I stick. That's it. I'm just going to go and set them on fire. <laughs> no, I'm not. Sauce. No, definitely not. <clears throat> set them on fire. This card here, it works with this card. It needs three cards. It's saying you just need to polymerization baby dragon and time wizard. But in the series, you used to age um, your baby dragon. So here was your baby dragon. And then you'd get a time wizard. That, him, that and that used to... The time wizard, you'd flip a dice and if you landed on the right one... He used to skip time thousands of years and then he would evolve to Thousand Dragon. So I might actually put them in a pack. Because they are, but I know I've always known that. Polymerization. And these aren't very. They are pretty good. I mean, that's probably the best one, Flame Swordsman, but they're not really like spectacular. But yeah, that's the unveiling today. This is how many cards I got, though. If you look at the pile, it's pretty hefty. And I've had fun, and I leaf, and I. We've had some fun today. Look at that deck. That's thick. Hella thick. And that's with the skill cards on top. Look at that proper flush with the top. Probably should have put them in the other way, shouldn't I? Gonna put them in width ways. Phone on 21% good charge. Yo, appreciate you, man. You have a good one, dude. Thank you so much for stopping by. You have a great day, my guy. The legendary Leif. Nice kid. Right, so I'm going to put the box back on these. So obviously one day I'll just pack it up and put them in the folder. I think I've took all the shinies out of them. They're, that's similar to that now. So I've took all the shinies out on the good cards. And then... And satay sticks. Banging. And these are the mats we got with them. Got four mats. Four whole mats. Oh, it's got Yugi on it as well. It's a Yugi mat. Let's go. It's actually, it doesn't do it like it used to. You used to have, to have a, a mat each, but it's just the mats for both players. So it's like a big, massive square. Yeah. Oh. It's got the old rules on there as well, guys. Right down. All the rules are there. Look, standard rules and stuff. All the rules are on there. And that's the map. That's the game. You see, like, all the spell trap card things. Very nice. Very nice map, to be fair, that is. 
Very happy with that map. Just the mat alone, guys. I'm happy with, mate. Oh, I'm not happy. I threw it on the floor. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just gonna um, I'm just gonna pack up the other cards. Can't believe I got four mats. That's pretty sick. Put all me rubbish somewhere in a pile. Yeah, they're beautiful, aren't they, guys? These. Skate Guardian, man. It's really nice. So I've got rid of all this rubbish. And, oh, God. Yeah, look, um, <clears throat> this card here in the back is her, him. <laughs> I, I was my ID for Call of Duty, that was. Um, him. That's him in the background, Gate Guardian. I have to take you to the card shop. I sometimes play... You would love it. Oh, guys, 100%, man. I'd really appreciate that. I really would. When was the last time you did it? I went there two weeks. What one did you play then? Was it that MLG, you said? MLG Cars? Did I get that right? MTG. What does that stand for? Cards. Right, I'm going to have a look now. I'm going to get my display capture up on my computer. And I'll have a look, mate. Yeah, I've, I've got some decent cards over here. These are all from today. These are all the good cards I've got from today. Decent fucking... Just a good deck on its own, this is. Just haven't had got trap cards or anything. Beautiful. Beautiful. Magic the Gathering. Oh, I see. Magic the Gathering. Guys, I'm totally with you now, my guy. That was probably the best card I got in here. Sly for the Sky Dragon. <clears throat> what I'm going to do is I'm going to sort out that other tin. I've got the deck box and everything, guys. Look how many cards are in here. This is wild. So I'll have a look. Have a look at Magic the Gathering. That's got gaming and war, but it's massive building with a bar and a cafe. Oh, nice! That's like a gaming retreat in Stratford, isn't it? M T G. Tory. Oh, is she playing proper M G? Proper tawnies, guys. They do a wicked breakfast there.
It's very similar to Yu Gi Oh, isn't it? Very similar. It's very similar. Necro Impotence. Where it's like it's a t how what's it at the beginning of your onkeep you may pay X life. Where's like his life points? Check out the shop you can see then play Yu-Gi-Oh. Oh yeah, that's what I'm saying. I would love to come down and have a look. Would be sick. Where's like their attack points, guys? I'm assuming it's like these symbols, is it? Quite clean, aren't they? Cracked. All right, I need to sort these out, guys. Got some cards, obviously, be cards in here. These need packeting. Oh, look at these. Got a load of shinies in there. And these are pretty standard. Look at it. Tokens. Yo, Death Crew. Thanks for the re. Re. Subscription. Thank you so much, guy. Re sub. Hey, yo, you've come to the party of Yu-Gi-Oh. I don't think we're gonna have enough sleeves. Not got many left, which sucks. Hey, yo, let's go. <clears throat> sleeve up, sleeve up. I have been, I have been. Thank you so much for the resub, man. Death Crew, Netherlands. Let's go. Thank you so much, dude. Right, there's six there. Who's dead? Me. Not me. So they'll go back in. JB! Yo! How are you doing? Legendary builders! Oi, oi! Oi, oi, Savaloy! JBster! The legend! Thank you so much for joining! How are the little ones, mate? Oh, mate, you've come along to the party of Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's go! Miss you as a family, Miles. Oh, everyone is living the life of Riley. Living the life of Riley. How are you doing? You guys are just beasts. Absolute beasts. I've seen you playing that, that Life of Pi, is it, JB? It looks an amazing game. It really does. I uh, paid you for doing that. That kind of looks like what I'd play, like Bloodborne or something. Love you, get. I know. I'm just putting my car. I've just done, done an unboxing. I've been unboxing for literally two hours. I, I've got these box. This one, thirty quid from game. And uh, the Speed Jewel one, also from game for fifteen ninety nine. And. And this legendary duelists, twelve ninety nine. F lies of pay. I thought you were liking it. It looks pretty good. You missed the pack sniffing. Let's go. Um, think you're following me? You guys are just too much for me. Honestly, I get lost in the storm. Storm caller. Why do you call it Pew not what well, I thought it was like what the life of Pew? <laughs> I'm calling it wrong, JB. I'm a noob, mate. Pie sniff Oh, the life of pie. Oh I don't know why I call it that. Is there a film? Yeah, words are hard. Spam that. What what is the word is life of P? Are you sure? Is there a film? Is the life of pie? 
There's a film in there, Life of Pi. No? What is it? It's about a tiger. What's that film where it's about a tiger and a boy? I'm sure it's Life of Pi. It's P. There's a film. Lies of Pi. Oh. Will Smith's son. Yeah, yeah. Lies of Pi, is that called? Sorry. I'm really sorry. And Death Crew, I've only got five sleeves left now. I've... But I've got so many on. <laughs> Crazy. No, he's not Will Smith's son. Dun dun dun. Who is it then? Is it Will Smith's cousin? Is it J? Is it, is it, is it JB? JB, are you Will Smith's son? <laughs> His name's Jaden, isn't it? Jaden Smithy. Labyrinth Tank, is that shiny? I think it is, you know. <laughs> Was. What he was his son. How do you change your dad? By Depot. I was trying to. If there's more than five, then I'm pretty effed. I think that's a, too many as it is. That's six. How many more? Seven. I've not got many. Damn it. Damn it. So I've got five there. I'll have to just do what I can. I'll do what I can. In there, so that's four. One more. The next one. And then another time I will sort of... Look at that. That's proper shiny, that. That's proper shiny. Michael P. Jordan. Nothing to do with bloody Will Smith. <laughs> Was? Nothing to do with, oh my God, Michael, Dana, JB wins. I Googled it. Oh, JB, she knows his shit. That's why, guys. I can't. I can't, JB, honestly. I'm a potato. Look at my face reflection here. Oh, 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 oh. I'll poke it. Beep, 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 beep. It's jokes. It's absolute jokes. Life is just one big joke, isn't it? And I, I went to a counselling session today, yeah, and uh, I literally said, it, it's not life's how hard ever you make it, but there's just tests all the time. Life just keeps throwing mini tests at you, or big tests, or medium tests, or large testes or tests. Just sends all this to you just to test you, see if you can take it. I, I miscounted as well, look. There's fucking six. I'm a stupid mini test. I'm getting the devil's testaments. At least he didn't say testicles. That would have been somewhere else. The devil's testes. That would be a good name for a film, wouldn't it? You see that new film, The Devil's Testes? Fucking hell, it was Boston. It had Michael B. Jordan in it. <laughs> Put it back in my deck box. Right, all the sleeves done. No, you've had them no good. Exact. Exact. There we go. Look at that. I should put them in the deck box, really, shouldn't I? They should be in the deck box. Well, I don't even know what I'm doing. Half the time. Don't know what I'm doing half the time. Gotta get me big tin hats. No, I've had them. Oh, oh, you've had the devil's testes. Oh, I'm with you now. JB, you should know how simple I am. I'm a simpleton. Just a simple, simple-minded fella. I probably could only operate two or three things. Got a collection over there. I've, yeah, this ain't even half of it. Death, this isn't even half. Don't, do not. Honestly, I wouldn't even explain. I wouldn't even use your Expelliarmus on me. That's one. That's the other one. I don't know where I put my gold got sarcophagus. But that's just got... That, that's just empty. I am going to start using this again. This is my gold sarcophagus. Pokemon cards next. <laughs> Guys. I've had this for a while now. But this card right here is worth 10 grand. This card right here, even in it's, it's got a massive 
tear there. That's still worth 10 grand. It sits right in front of me here every day. It sits right in front of my face, right here, next to, on my desk setup. I could literally, like, if I just tilt the camera, right there. Boom. Right on there. I got him right there, and I get chingy, 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 man, man, how we get flimmy. 10 grand, yeah? That exact one. It's this number here, the 4102. Even in its condition. That's what I was offered, Def. Someone offered me 10 grand for it. And I said, no. It's too much sentimental value. Doesn't that only go for... They'd be able to get more when it was graded. They can restore it. The guys told me it would get it restored. It'd be worth more than that. But I, I'm not interested, Def. I'm not interested. It's going to sit there in front of me until the day I die. <laughs> That's what it's going to do. That's what it's going to do. It's going to sit there, mate. I've had that since I was probably six years old, if not younger. I've also been, I've also got a um, buy a house. You will not be able to buy a house for 10 grand, JB. I'm, to buy a house, you'd need about 40. My bank says, if I go on my banking app, it says 21 grand and they will help with the rest to, to get your deposit for the house. But obviously your mortgage repayments will be sky high. But he's like, nah, no, nah, I wouldn't do that. No way. I wouldn't do that. So in my gold sarcophagus, Def, I will quickly show you. I've got fake Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Can't believe you have your tech. I know. I couldn't believe it because he obviously knows because of the code on it and stuff. Because of the codes, Def. Look, here's my other tin inside the sarcophagus. I would say offer me 25. No, I wouldn't ever get rid of it, Def. Honestly. I, I, if I ever died, you can have it, though. These are fake cards. I've got fake Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Look how fake this one is here. These are all fake. You can actually get done for having these too. Listen, it's not even foil. It's a real strange material. So I keep them fake ones in there, you know, because I'm just part of the mafia. A mafioso, lads and lasses. And like I say, it's time to do 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 There we go, lads and lasses. Here's me Pokemon cards, JB. You did say Pokemon cards, didn't you? I get I sent some to Death Crew as well into the Netherlands. Here's me Pokemon cards. I've not got as big a collection as I used to have. I've got, I have got some others somewhere, but these are like the most valuable ones that I keep close to my soul. No, no, Def, I don't keep them close to my penis. Just my soul. My arsehole. <laughs> Def, don't make me laugh. It's you. I've lost so many cards. I know, I'm me over the years. It's crazy. Send them to the nether regions. I have. I bloody have, lad. I bloody did, mate. Oh, nearly dropped me cards. So this is a quick Pokemon card scan, guys. I know people obviously know Pokemon more than Yu-Gi-Oh. So we've got a Snorlax, a Chansey, a Pikachu, my balls are sore, a Vin Vincent, Smeargle, Growly, Cheppy, Tricky, Lady, Brr, Rowly, Teg Pit, Teb, Tepig. That's a funny name, isn't it? Well, I got kicked out before I was 18 years old, did you? Oh my God. So sorry to hear that, Dad. So much on the... I've always wanted to ask you questions, mate. Beautifly, Drampa. These are new cards. See, I do like the new cards, but I prefer the old ones. I should keep them separate, shouldn't I? So here are the old ones, look. Vaporeon. You're 16, guys. You're fucking geeking me, dog. Connects, Lego, Pokemon cards, and lots more. All lost to the fire. Gaz, how much? Oh my God, Death Crew. At the car boot sale, I know at least five people who would pay serious money for Lego. They go to the car boot with, I'd like to say hundreds, maybe thousands of pounds just to buy Lego. It's that crazy. It's that crazy. 
Yeah, I know, guys. That's what I'm saying. I can't believe it. And he and he's awesome as a kid. That's uh, this is obviously my childhood here. I've managed to get right, get keep all mine. They buy anything Lego. Yeah, you know the, the other mate, Gaz, isn't it? Gaz and Gaz. That's legendary. That's legendary. Look at this here as well. How much checking that's worth, Def? I've never checked. A Japanese Typhlosion. A Japanese fucking Typhlosion, mate. I've never even checked the price. Is that to rebuild? Yeah, you do, don't you? Yeah, that's what I like to do. This Hitmonchan is so battered, it's insane. So battered. Dark Gyarados. The normal Gyarados. Muck. Yanmar. Rowley. I don't know for 50 quid. <laughs> 20p. Polyrath. Hypno. I've got some on the back as well, look. Hypno. Polyrath. Nido King. Obviously, Nido Queen. Goes without saying. Raichu, that one's on its own. Jolteon, Magneton, and then the others. <clears throat> I know nothing. I know nothing, guys. I know nothing, mate. So, yeah, that's my Pokemon done. I think I've sleeved all the ones I needed to sleeve. I need to go through them again and re-sleeve. I also get dice as well. You get dice with it, too. Be cool, isn't it? I like dice. This is the one I got today. Beautiful. Just as a collectible, isn't it? Just as a collectible. Very nice. I close my eyes. There you were. Right, guys. Um, might have a little blast on Fortnite. What do you reckon, guys? Should I play Fortnite? Have a little blast. Good. Have a little blast, oh, kid. What do you reckon, mate? Don't lose them. Fortnite or Apex? Go on, lad. All right, then, man. I have one game of zero build. One game of zero build. Just got to pack this away. Got to pack this away. Oh, don't you see? I got a, I got a binder as well. Let me show you that in a minute, mate. Tech box can go somewhere. Rubbish. Go on, lad. Are you Jack the lad, or are you Gaz? Gaz lad. Gaz the Jack lad. You got a jet lag, Gaz lad. I didn't know game was so good for you, Gear. It's like been such a blessing for me today. I brought this binder as well. Tenor. You can't even get a binder this cheap off um, Amazon. Holds 180 cars as well. <laughs> Thick as spooky. <laughs> so I'm gonna I'll quickly open this up so we can see what it looks like. But it looks beautiful. It really does. I love binders as well. I've always had a thing for binders. Anyone else had a thing for binders? Yay, nay. Yay, nay. I bet your death crew's got a thing for binders. Tell you what, it's so hard to get in as well, guys. I'm going to have to do the knife technique without killing myself. Cut away from yourself is what I always learned. You always learn. Just simple. Oh, this feels super smooth. Super smooth. It's a binding contract, Death. You're correct. It's beautiful. Oh, Gaz. That smells like a wet dream. That smells like niceness. <laughs> Gaz, for that wait, what? What are you saying there? Honestly, that smells so good. Oh, my God. Check this. Check it. Beautiful, isn't it? Absolutely stunning. Binded. There's his all the cards going it. See, we've got a bit of paper in there, like. Woo! Whoop. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful, that is. I've got two binders now. Ugh. Two binders. Got to sort them out. Sort them out. 
and all that washing. <laughs> ah, there we go, guys. Oh, I've really enjoyed that. Thank you so much, everyone, for sticking around for that. Honestly, it was really fun. I really enjoyed it. Got so much. Stuff. I've still got these all full of cards as well. Death Crew. I've got so much from that. So, so much. I appreciate anyone who's stuck by the stream as well. And Death Crew comes in with a sub as well. You know, JB as well coming through. Guys, you're all legends, man. And so very soon, I'm going to be doing some Mario Kart. So if anyone's got their Switch, mate, we're going to go in some Mario Kart if anyone's on it. Like the carb on it. <clears throat> What's the time, guys? So I say quarter to eight. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'll have a quick game of Fortnite. Fortnite. I've cleaned up all the cards. Have a swig of me black current. Do you have my Harry Potter um, power bank as well? I got this as a nostalgia thing, but I do actually use it quite a lot. It's actually pretty cool. <clears throat> And this is my new PS5 pad I got. Carly brought me this for my birthday. So nice. It feels so smooth. Love it, guys. So nice. Yeah. The blade used. That's cool. I have a cool power bank. So, yeah, they are. They really are useful. I've got a white one as well here. You ever use Team U? Let me look. I'll show you these goggles I've got of Team U. They're so good. I got this power bank as well. So I used the two. I got some earpods as well. Earpods as well off Team U. They're so good. They're in the uh, oven. Check out these goggles off Team U. Three pound. Three pound. They come a day after I arrived. Uh, I went on holiday. A day after, I needed them before the holiday. I was so gutted. I use similar to PS4. Team U, first purchase is cheap, then back to normal price, isn't it? Yeah, 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 it is. I got this drone for three pound and then it was up for 30. It was insane. Can't even, I haven't even opened this, but these were three pound. I can just tell they look like the shit. I needed them for when I went on holiday, but they come a day after, which sucked. It's so hard to open. Oh. An anti-fog. Anti-fog goggles. They're nice, aren't they? Three quid. Smell brand new, guys. And these little bad boys go in your lug holes, kid. Stops the water going in your ears. Can't even hear anything right now. These goggles are mint. I love these goggles already. They're beautiful, aren't they? Really nice goggles. Oh, how nice are them? Three quid. Team you. Bloody team you. Yeah. I don't know why I say team you like emu. I can't, I didn't even get to use them on holiday. I'm gutted. Didn't even get to use them like, it's pretty gutting like. Pack it as well. It's actually quite clever. I didn't know how to do it. You just twist that and there's like a latch on the inside. So you do that and just twist it in and it locks it in place. This shit thing. This thing here I got here. I got a refund for it, but they said you can keep it. It's like a little mini grabber, but for a kid. For a baby. Oh. So you're like. It's really complicated, man. Look, you move your grabber and then you pull that down. And then you have to try and grab. It's so hard. 
So I got a refund for it. Which is... Chet. <laughs> Guys, yeah. Let's have a game of Fortnite. You know what? You know what? 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 What, Dev? What? Shall I do a chatting stream soon? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's what I've just what I've just done today. That's I've literally just done that today, Death. Done exactly the same. But you said you're gonna show them, so I might do the same as that. But I haven't really got I'm not as organized probably as you. I'd love to see it, Death, to be honest. I would love to see it. Gaza would love to see it. I would love to see it. I'll let you lick me armpit. I need to sort out camera position. Do you want to see what mine's doing? Do you want to see my camera position? <sighs> oh, so you have two point of views. Oh, so not like mine then. So I've got this webcam and this one. So and for this one, look, I'll show you. I've got it. Yeah, it's two cameras. I've got it here balanced so it's looking down on the desk here look this is a phone holder look this is just a phone holder held on by my old playstation remote just to hold the webcam like that it's just a 1080p webcam look if you do that it goes lengthways it's awesome man's got skills you know obvious obviously guys lad so I'm gonna just do that. Get this on. <laughs> I'm wearing joggers. Your zipper is open, mate. <laughs> Death stop. <laughs> You're gonna give me an aneurysm, mate. Full on aneurysm. <laughs> 